Hi guys, this is Malone Chip and welcome back to Conan Exiles. So today schedule, I've been thinking hard about it and well, I yesterday I talked about the limitations that recording brings and definitely the, well, the way I want to bring it. Uh, I told you that I, I don't want to bring content that, well, I don't want to do stuff alone. Uh, I want to bring everything that I experienced for the first time. Uh, I want to record it, uh, but it kind of puts a limitation on what you can do. Uh, we came across the cave, but the cave wasn't in the plan yesterday. So today, I wanna, it's been on my mind the entire night. So I want to do that cave. I want to find out what's in there and uh, what may actually kill us. And as we were talking yesterday about uh, restrictions, I kind of want to do the jungle, the second part of the jungle. Because there is a couple like the jungle heads uh, from the gorilla and from the different birds that we need. So that's all kind of in a little process. But I also want to check out, as you can see, we have a whole lot of gear. And that kind of made me think about what I want to make my next room of. And I, I'm thinking something like, I don't know, a catwalk, Like uh, people dressing up and showing every... Um, shaman gear and every every piece of gear because right now the gears that we have they're basically in our vault and you can't really look at it uh, i told you that we kind of want to dress up the different npcs that are around the base in different types so we can um like the uh the hyborians will have the, well i'm talking about hyborians are there hyborians like the nordheimers will have a different i think the nordheimers will have these sets i kind of like these sets with the horns and then we're gonna give like every uh, different type of npc different type of clothing so we can actually see oh that's yeah that's right that's one of those that's one of those we can in differentiate them a little bit damn i'm using way too much uh hard words <laughs> lately but for today um I kind of want to set up a little heavier armor. Uh, I kind of want to check out the Hyborian Slaver armor as well. As you can see, it also uses fur, so it has a little... I think it's one piece with iron, two pieces with iron, and then if we look at this, it's again fur, so two pieces with fur. And then the waist guard is actually fur and iron bars. Um, I did pick up all the, uh, the linen tassets uh, and the linen gloves, so all we need is some iron, 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 there we go, let's take 200, should be more than enough, I think I only needed 100, but hey, better more than less, so heavy Hyborian slaver boots, the braces, the helmet, the waist, and the chest, I think, the waist, and uh, the cloth, and the chests. There we go. Boots are already ready. Um, something else I kind of, well, that kind of went into my mind yesterday is that we could not climb the ice. But at the second when I was actually thinking about it a little bit, those are the building pieces. We did find some equipment that can actually help us. Climbing boots. As you know, the climbing boots have spikes and... Well, it makes sense, right? To climb ice, you need spiked boots. So I'm definitely going to keep those in my inventory when we go to the winter biomes. Because, um, yeah, I want to make sure that I can get out and get away from certain creatures when I'm not able to kill them or if they're going to one-shot me. Uh, well, if they one-shot me. As you can see, I've put up a couple, uh, just three little ones. And why is there no water in here? I definitely know that there was water in, in them a second ago. Hmm. Yeah, there's no water in here. I know when I set them up, I saw the water rising. Hold enter for more options. Interact, dismantle and cancel. That's strange. I know I logged out and logged back in because uh, it was nighttime and I kind of want to start recording and not wait for the nighttime, but no water. Eh, yeah, like I said, kind of strange. I actually wanted to put them on top uh, near our flowers. That kind of makes sense because flowers need water as well. And 
it's easier to have a water well uh, nearby so you don't have to run outside and for me as well running towards the uh, well the lake here it's not that far but it, it, it's a little hustle uh, every time running there and, and running back seriously no water uh, but yeah, as I wanted to place them up uh, top, the water well is actually like, you, you can see the still the part that's on top, it goes all the way to like one foundation, like that's the complete height. So if I would place it on the top levels, it would basically stick through the floor. Uh, yeah, cannot have that. Dude, why are you not working? So let's check out this new slaver armor. Oh, no, this one, this one. The helmet, boots, and braces. Holy hell. Um. <laughs> um. I don't know what you guys are thinking, but this is more something like. I don't know. <laughs> I really don't know what I need to think about this, guys, but. I can honestly say I'm not going to walk around like this. Uh, it's more funny than it actually... I, I, yeah, I, I'm losing words. I, it, doesn't look, it doesn't look all that good. In my, 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 in my book, like, it, 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 we're, we're basically naked. How can this ever be heavy armor and protect us? 351? And how much does the fur one do? 179 so yeah definitely heavy armor but it 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 just doesn't look good it just doesn't look good um okay so we've seen that one uh let's see if we can craft up another one because this one uh yeah no 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 will do i i'm not gonna wear i'm not gonna wear that <laughs> the aquilium bracers that are medium right do we have any other heavy set this is also medium do we have a heavy set? The reptilian boots is also medium. The soldier braces were heavy, but we've already seen that. The fur. All right, there was the Vanner heavy boot with the steel bar. Yeah, let's craft up that. So we need steel and fur. I presume steel, steel, steel. Not sure if we actually, because I have not really. Oh yeah, steel. We haven't got hardened steel. Um, well, we got the little parts that I have left, but I've kind of neglected my uh, farming a little bit. Uh, no, why am I opening this box? Don't eat that box. And steel bars. Let's stick to 100. I'm not going to need them, but... Oh, steel. Damn, this set looks awful. <laughs> it actually looks so awful. Uh, okay, let's go up. We're going to need some... Uh, well, the linings, the, the the bindings that we need to craft the gear. I think this was the gear vault. And we should have, yeah, heavy chest, we need one. Uh, heavy boot linings, we need two. Heavy gauntlet linings, we need two. And a heavy padding, we need one. And then the heavy leggings, we need one. There we go. Let's see what that one looks like, because we are going to go to the winter biome, to the cave, so I expect that we're going to need a little um, ice protection or, or cold protection uh, itself. Let's see, can I get everything still in here? Yeah, it's a close one, but I can still get everything in there. What is this? Yeah, that's also medium. Where was it? Where was it? Where was it? Fenner boots. Fenner heavy boots. So there's steel and okay, craft one. The Fenner heavy gauntlets, craft one. Fenner heavy helmet. The heavy chest, and I presume this is the last piece. And what are these Fenner settlings? So that those are the ones that we. No, those are the linen ones. Some Morian thief linen. Yeah, those are all light armors. The boots. The gloves, we're missing a part. Uh, the waist, Fenner fur tacit. Where where is it? Heavy tacit. Why didn't we build that? 
Have you tested, right? Graphon. I thought I clicked them all. 24 bars, though, for one. Yeah, the city, um, old, new, new Azagard is a really nice place. As I said, steel, I'm actually more like killing the NPCs and grabbing it over there than creating it myself. So what does this set look like? Can we get that last piece created before we head out? Before I get a little more set up uh, in gears already outside dark again. Let's see. Uh, heavy pauldrons, heavy tacit, uh, third armus, uh, third tacit. Is it that's that one? Slaver helmet, um, armor value twenty three. Heavy boots, uh, better heavy gauntlets, fur boots. Where the heavy and the heavy helmet? I think this is a complete set. Heavy, heavy, heavy fur. So we need this one and heavy. What does it look like? Let's stand in the light a little bit more. Yeah, this does look like like it actually will give protection, right? So yeah, definitely a set that I like. Um, it's kind of closed off. I don't want to run. The fur boots really, really look warm. Like it actually looks warm. And what's our protection right now? 481. That should give a lot more protection than the other ones. I'm going to put my gears away that I don't need. I'm going to put the armors away that I don't need. Grab some Eloa extracts. Uh, so we have some regen. And oh, then head on to the cave. Before we actually head on out, there's actually two things we do need to do. And that's something we need to do every time we get here. Uh, kill the bear. See if he can get his hit. And check out if he can find that cook. If he can make that named cook spawn. Let's first kill this bear. Let's see if he actually gives us a head today. What the hell was that? Are you running over me? Come on. Come on. There we go. Cleaver. Can we get your head? Feral flesh. Feral flesh. No head. Hello. Mr. Named Cook. Are you here today? Archer. No closer. No closer. Don't really care. Fighter level one this time. Not a big issue. Arch level two. Nordheimer cook level one. Yeah. No luck today. We'll see when we get home. Maybe later if he actually spawned. All right. Here he, the birdie is again. Uh, and he's not making any sound. <laughs> eh, it's not the first part. Now, do you have a head? That's what I'm wondering. I don't think he's gonna have a head. Feral flesh. And the second one. Chills roots. Oh, I'm at the second cave. <laughs> oh, crap, where's the other one? Oh, the other one's down there. I actually made the big walk around and actually claim, uh, climbed this this little top. But actually, the cave we wanted to do is that one down there. Holy hell. Okay, I, I think I took a wrong turn here somewhere. Uh, okay, uh, let's, let's, let's go into this one. Maybe they, they link up. Don't hope that it's gonna be too dark. Not sure if you guys can properly see in here right now. So far, not too many scary things. I presume that these birds will inhabit these caves. Or bird-like, uh, human bird-like creatures. So far, nothing really that should scare me. If I can kill them. But they're not actually doing any damage. So. There we go. No. Demon blood. Ooh. I think that's something new as well. Okay. Is there a floor beneath here? I think there is. 
Well, oh, there's a lighting in the top. Okay. Yeah, come at me. Come at me, bro. Yeah, yeah. Now let me do my routine. I see the death damage difference that we do. There we go. So yeah, make sure that we collect all the demon blood that we can. Not sure where we're gonna need it for. Let's go through here. Let's pull in some light attacks as well. There's been a lot of people here though. Or they um, actually like pulled people uh, in here from the outside. That's possible as well, of course. No real way down. Is there actually a down? There is a down here. It's dark. Uh, let's go up first. See if we can find anything noteworthy up there. And if we can get on there, we should be able to with our uh, stamina right now. I haven't seen what extra stats this gear actually gives. A couple nests here. Yeah, excuse me if it's kind of too dark, guys. Um, it can't help it. I Or I should equip like a, well, a sword, uh, a one-handed sword. And that way I can hold the torch and hit at the same time like I'm doing now. Demon blood and some feathers. Let's definitely take those. I think I'm running a little short. Plus, we can get uh, put everything in the base before we head out back to the other biome if we can get there today. Because well, it's it's two caves right now that we're gonna need to explore. Anything up top here? Ooh, a passage. Okay, okay. And another one of the birdies. Let's knock him off this cliff. Make sure that we don't drop off. So, yeah, there's still a bottom that we haven't searched yet. What is over here? Let's equip the fire as long as we can. Apparently it's not really giving me any any heat. I would presume that if you put up a torch that this cave is, is humongous. That would actually give some um, extra warmth for a little while. But yeah, that's not the case I think. Because we don't see heating up when we do that. A lot of feral flesh. Let's get rid of that. There we go. Nothing down here. Oh, nothing in here as well. Got a lot of demon birds. Did he just do like a gush of wind at me? Yeah, it's... It's actually like a gush of wind that he uh, blows with his uh, wings. Actually nice. A uh, good way if you are like in a, the sequence of combat with, with your weapons. A good way to actually stop it is just equip equip the other another tool. And that way you instantly stop the uh, weapon attack. You don't actually need to finish it. And one more. Come on. There we go. Let's drink. Make a shell. Uh, drinking here does not make it colder. Big cave, though. Big cave. Another discovered the scraps. Yeah, it kind of makes me think that all these, all these caves are kind of hooked up. 
So I'm gonna make my way back through the cave and we're gonna uh, check out uh, the bottom one because I kind of think that the bottom one, uh, the bottom that we didn't actually uh, look at right now is actually a connection to the lower part of the cave. Like it's a, an entire cave system. Um, so yeah, I'll bring you guys back uh, once we go below what we already saw. Let's see if there's an actual connection between the caves. And let's heal up a bit before something really amazing and big tries to squash us in one hit. Is this just a, a bottomless pit? Was I wrong? Because it would be cool. Yeah, I think I was wrong about it. It would have been cool because the, the other uh, tunnel is lower than this one. So it would have been cool that we have a pathway going towards that other cave. Can I get on? Might have to... Unequip some gear. Let's see, come on, come on, come on. Can I get on here? Let's regain our stamina. How does it look? Uh, that's a little high up. I think through here is gonna be better. We can always strip our gear and then just walk, of course. And let's make a jump. And that should do it, actually. Perfect. Okay, so let's run back. I'm gonna head towards the other cave. Uh, kinda was thinking that it would be connected. But yeah, no connection and no chests. Like, this is an awesome place to, to actually have some chests and some valuables in it. But yeah, no go. He's still dead. And let's head on downstairs. Make sure we have some stamina before we drop down. And let's head on down to this side. There we go. Why are you walking crouched? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know there's a lot of you guys here. And if I would actually hit them, I would actually be able to kill them. Oh, I thought I could, could kill him in my second swing, both of them. They're not carrying anything from loot, right? No. Probably not. Let's use the cleaver. Let's get some more demon blood. Does it have a... No, it doesn't have a timer, so that's good. That means we can just farm it up and keep it in the base. Well, let's see what this cave will bring. Will it bring me to another entrance? And it's gonna be dark again. Again, guys, I kind of apologize for this. Um, I do need to check out if we actually... Well, we have the health now and we have the regen. We have the proper armors. Uh, if I just shouldn't be using, like, uh, the one-handed ones. Because I cannot log out and log back in to make it a little more brighter. Maybe I could do gamma or something like that. Maybe that will work. There we go. Okay. Now that we can see, can we actually find something? What's that? Blue markings on the wall. Okay. What else? What else? Feathers. A bunch of them. Ooh. A chest. Okay, let's heal up. And let's, um, let's fight them all at the same time. <laughs> let's regenerate. Make sure we are cold. There are some on top of the edge as well. It's not going to be a boss here. Damn, it's, it's way too dark. Even for me, it's kind of too dark to play in this. I'm gonna definitely check the footage if, if it's not... If it's not usable, I, I might just have to cut it out. I'm not sure. Come on! Just die so I can give the people some light. And don't kill me. 
Holy hell, look at that interrupt from the... I'm gonna need to heal. Heal up. Come on, come on, come on. Well, they're birds, right? They probably don't have the understanding of fire yet. And more. And now it's really getting dark. Is it nighttime outside? Does that have? Does that actually have any difference? Because now I can't even see myself. So on recording, it's gonna be even, even, even harder. Uh, I'm gonna do a quick log out and log back in. See if it actually changes something. Exactly as I thought, um, when it's uh, light outside, it actually becomes more light inside. And there is some f uh, visibility right now, not a lot, but there is some enough that I can actually kind of record. <laughs> so yeah, I am going to cut out most likely all the darkest things in the... Recording two more out of stamina, let's regen. Oh, and everything spawned again? That's not, that's not good. Let's heal. I know I pulled the ones at the top. Yeah, if they all do their wind techniques at the same time, I might die here actually. Come on, do those heavy swirls, kill everything. Ooh, that was a close one. That really was a close one. I'm lucky that the ones on top cannot get down, although they can fly. Like, kind of doesn't make any sense. But... Wait, wasn't there a chest here? A second ago? Wait, what? You all saw that, right? There was a chest in there. Did I break it with my... Is it possible to break them? I presume it's possible to break them. Okay, let's see if we can get up here. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming to you in a second. Give me some time to check if I can climb up here. Throw it feels dry. And we're up. Anything noteworthy on top, except for more of those birds. Let's see, not really anything. Let's drink a little bit. Let's eat. Oh, we didn't need to. Scar talon. Oh, there's scar talons. Rich line. And let's whack them all. That's one. Come on. Come on. That's two. And come on. out of stamina. That's not good. And three. There we go. Anything here except for the birds? No, nothing really here except for birds. Ooh. Ooh. Close one. So, yeah, uh, be careful um, swinging around your sword because you can trash the boxes. Oh, a bear. Can you give me your head? I kind of need your head. Sorry, Teddy. And a little light smack. Can you give me your head? Fair flesh. Brown bear head. Hell yes. Nice. So that's something else we can put up. And what are you? What are you? I don't hope it's a named one. Because I don't have my equipment to knock something out. Blacksmith. 
wo ist denn los? Mr. Blacksmith. Hey, dude. Freya's hovel. Yeah. So I presume that's gonna be Freya. Freya and an archer. Yeah, Freya the archer. Crap! I don't have anything to knock her out. She's still here, right? I think she is. Another blacksmith, level one again. It was his second NPC. Oh, he's still dead. Oh, no. Here's the other one. Let's go behind the house so Freya can't hit us. It's level three this time. Not that it matters too much. Hey, Freya. And we are gonna need to, well, run it all the way back to the... You're not doing any damage. I can just tank you. Yeah, just, yeah, interrupt me a couple times, cripple me. There we go. And... Come on, come on, just a couple more hits. There we go, knocked out. And let's drag her back to... Well, new as a guard. <laughs> uh, that's gonna be a little run. Can't go off here. Oh, then I die. Let's take a regular route. We are here. Uh, you can't see it, but I can. It's 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 a dark, dark episode. Uh, and apparently, yeah. I've well logging in, logging off. Uh, the, even the cook from yesterday is not done yet. Can I pull the cook without pulling anything else? Doesn't look like it. Come at me. Fighter level 2. And Archer level 1. He should die in a couple hits. Nordheimer Cook level 1. Oh, the brown bear. To which part of the collection does he belong? I think it was the northern... Uh, survival, no weapons, decorations. Wasn't Highland Hunter? Yeah, Brown Bear, Sabertooth, Elk King, and the Elk Trophy. So basically, you kind of need to get this trophy down as well because he needs to be on a wall together with the bear. Uh, let's do the bear a little higher, no? A little lower, no? Something like this. And the Elk King, because, well, they do belong together. I think that's the middle. There we go. So, Brown Bear, Elk King, I th think we need an Elk and a Saber Tooth. And then we have all four of the Highlands uh, done. I thought I was going to do signs, but if you come close enough, it actually shows it. Elk King. I kind of wanted to make like, uh, I was thinking like making a sign with Highland creatures then. But the signs itself are kind of kind of small. Uh, it's, it's barely readable. I was thinking of making like we have some, uh, what they already called again, like the, the, the fence, uh, not fence post, but like it's a bigger sign that you could place here. But then it just would obstruct the wall. So yeah, didn't do that one. And now we have one, two, uh, three, three, four walls already uh, filled. Five walls already filled with some creatures. So yeah, we're getting along. We're getting along. If we can do a couple hits every episode, we uh, we might be able to process that a little faster. Well, not faster, but eventually we'll get everything uh, done and completed. Anyway, guys. I'm going to cut it here. Hope you enjoyed the episode and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.